Hello my sexy muffins and welcome back to another video. In this video it is going to be Peter with pansexual Peter from your boyfriend which we do not support the creator what the creator has or has not done just disclaimer on that but we are so doing pansexual Peter from your boyfriend x male bisexual pansexual for Peter I don't know if I said that right pansexual for Peter your boyfriend x bisexual male listener and I'm going to be doing it from Peter's point of view so I'll be saying I am me but I will be speaking as if I was Peter sorry for my shit voice act and I'll hopefully be able to edit it out in that but anyways this is basically the Peter narrated into himself how he feels for you the male listener that is by and yes let's do this but first disclaimer Yandere's Peter is Yandarian canon and is pansexual in canon. Also, disclaimer, part two. Y Yandarian and fictional characters are fine to simp for as long as you keep fiction and reality separate. And remember to, uh, to not be illegal or gross about it. Everyone is canon 18. If you are not 18 and you are watching my videos, what the heck is wrong with you? Go shoot this is not the place for you if you're younger than 18. anyways yes anyways let's continue so, and sim for them is fine as long as you separate from fiction reality yada 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 yonders are not ideal partners to have in real life if you do have one or want one in real life just really weigh your options and you do you and make sure you're safe and everyone around you is safe and that you trust your partner I don't know. You do, you do, fam. Anyways, let's do this. Again, this is me narrating as if Peter is speaking. So when I say I am me, imagine is Peter. I'll try, I'll try to do some editing of my voice and editing. Okay, let's go. <clears throat> I really am jealous of all the people that get to be around him. He's just so darn beautiful. He's my boyfriend, but he doesn't even know that I exist yet. I'm one day going to tell him how I feel and tell him that I am his boyfriend and that we were meant to be one day very soon. I watch him as he works at the diner working as hard as he can to make ends meet. I know his shitty roommate Lucy isn't doing anything to help pay rent and it really pisses me off. I hate it. I hate it in my very core. She should be supporting him in rent, but more so she should be living near me where he cannot be taken advantage of by some loose lips that seek fits. I hated her with a passion. She is such a slut. She does not deserve to be able to share an apartment with them. More so, I hated his co worker, TK. They did not deserve. Near my boyfriend. My boyfriend needed me and only me. If I had it my way, he would be at home, safe and sound, away from anyone that can take him away. I had watched him for a couple of weeks now, and I knew that he liked both females and males, and his non binary friend, TK. I hated to take your passion, always being close to my your name. I hated them. I hated TK more than anyone. They did not deserve to be near my boyfriend. I glare at, at them hatefully. They walked to my boyfriend as they put their hand on his back. I glared at them. They should be not touching my boyfriend. Boyfriend, and your name belongs to me. I watch as your name goes back to the kitchen to sit and take a break. And TK comes over and takes my order. I am planning on giving them a lousy tip and maybe talking to their manager. Hopefully the manager is in so I can speak to them and get them hired. So then my darling, your name, will not have to deal with them. As, as my food came, I continued to watch and soon he came out again. I smile as he seemed a little bit refreshed and he went back to wait in tables. Oh, how I wish I could 
take him away from Argus and keep him safe. I have more than enough money to take care of him and give him the life he deserves. And I'm going to give him the life he deserves. I will make sure of that. I finish my meal as soon as your name gets off of his shift and then leave the lousy tip for TK just to fuck with him. I watch, I walk behind Garnin as I follow him to his uh, apartment. I wanted to make sure that he was safe and sound and that no one would hurt him because I would not be able to stand it. I continue walking and following him, doing my best to keep a distance but stay in running distance if he were to be hurt by someone. As soon as we made it back to as soon as we made it back to his apartment, I watch him go in and wait out his window. As he gets into his room, he takes off his clothes. I stop and stare, feeling a stir inside me. I wanted him so bad, but I knew I could not have him. As soon as he is in his pajamas and into bed, I climb in as he falls asleep. I shove a rag against his face, and he doesn't wake up as the chloroform acts fast. And then I get on top of him and kiss his cheek, holding him close. I can hear his slut of a roommate, Lucy, getting, her, getting plowed in the room next door. And I take the advantage of holding my darn your name in my arms. <laughs> they, he is so perfect, and I love that I am able to hold him finally and be able to be with him. I cannot get enough of him. I needed him more and more every day. I needed him more than anyone else. And I cannot wait to confess to him tomorrow in the park. Tell him I'm his boyfriend. And that we are going to go on our very first date. Anyways, that's the intro to it. Uh, that might just be a part one. I don't know if I'm going to do a part two, if you would like to see part two. Maybe comment below you would like to see it. I'll maybe put a vote up for it as well. Anyways, I hope that you all enjoyed, and stay sexy. All my sexy muffins, Bye bye Wait. Remember, semi-requests are open, and if you would like to see more Your Boyfriend content, I will have a playlist for you guys to... Uh, see of uh, your boyfriend stuff, hopefully, and um, maybe a suggested video or two for you to check out and all that, and yeah, should I do a part two of this? Comment it below. And should I do a prequel, maybe short, of how he met you? And how he first saw you, and how long he's been stalking you and stuff? Comment that below if you would want to see that as well. And yeah, I hope you all enjoyed. And stay sexy, all my sexy muffins. Bye-bye.